Here we go. Hello, welcome to Noonday Prayer at St. Mark's. Sorry if you tried to join on the other one. There is some uh, technical issues on my end. So hopefully everyone finds their way uh, back to this one. Uh, please say hi in the comments and put any prayer requests that you have uh, in the comments as well. And we'll get started in just a few minutes. Let's see. Hello, Margaret. Hello, Frida. Good morning. <clears throat> Noonday Prayer begins on page 103 of the Book of Common Prayer. We'll get started in just a little bit. Hi, Patricia. Good morning. Hi, Frida. Hi, Karen. Good morning. It's good to be back and see y'all. Margaret will pray for safe travels home and, and give thanksgiving for safe travels home. Hi, Karen. Good morning. We'll get started in just about a minute here. For those just joining us, uh, Noonday Prayer starts on page 103 of the Book of Common Prayer. Yay, I'm glad you made it back, Margaret. Glad you had safe travels, too. All right, it is noon, so we will get started. O God, make speed to save us. O Lord, make haste to help us. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Alleluia. Psalm 119. Your word is a lantern to my feet and a light upon my path. I have sworn and am determined to keep your righteous judgments. I am deeply troubled. Preserve my life, O Lord, according to your word. Accept, O Lord, the willing tribute of my lips, and teach me your judgments. My life is always in my hand, yet I do not forget your law. The wicked have set a trap for me, but I have not strayed from your commandments. Your decrees are my inheritance forever. Truly, they are the joy of my heart. I have applied my heart to fulfill your statutes forever and to the end. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. A reading from Paul's letter to the Romans. The love of God has been poured into our hearts, through the Holy Spirit that has been given to us. Thanks be to God. Lord, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Lord, hear our prayer, and let our cry come to you. Let us pray. Blessed Savior, at this hour you hung upon the cross, stretching out your loving arms. Grant that all the peoples of the earth may look to you and be saved, for your tender mercy's sake. Amen. In our St. Mark's prayer list, 
We pray for the Episcopal Church, for Justin, the Archbishop of Canterbury, Michael, the presiding bishop, Larry, our bishop, our clergy, Joanna, Michael, Patricia, and Stuart, our staff and vestry, in the Anglican cycle of prayer, we pray for the Diocese of Machakos, the Anglican Church of Kenya. and the Diocesan cycle of prayer, we pray for St. Francis House and its ministries. We pray for Camp Mitchell and give thanksgiving for their return to camp uh, this summer. We pray for St. Paul's Fayetteville and St. Martin's University Center at the University of Arkansas in Fayetteville. We pray for peace. We pray for an end to racism, terrorism, oppression, poverty, pollution, and persecution. We pray for all our staff at St. Mark's, especially this week, Tim Allen, the organist and choir master, and for all our parish ministries, especially this week, St. Mark's prayer shawl ministry. We pray for the safety of first responders, healthcare workers, and those in the military, especially Megan, Sam, Breen, Marshall, Garrett, and Kyle. We pray for all families who are expecting children, Louie and Libby Whitbeck Wood, Hayward and Olivia Wetzel. We pray for all parishioners who are in need, sick or homebound, and for those commended to our prayers, Rachel, Beth and Don, Donna and Jean, Teal, Spencer, Francis, Garrel and Mary, Julia, Jeremy, Wilbur, Harley, John, Jean, Joel, Allie, Rick, Shirley, Charlotte and Corey, Megan and Jeanette, Aracillus and DeWolf, Enol, Jordan, Rick, Peggy, Joyce, Barbara, Jackie, Mac, Shelly, and Patricia. We pray for all those who are celebrating birthdays today and all those who are celebrating wedding anniversaries, and we pray for those who have died. In our Facebook prayer list, we pray for, we give thanksgivings for Margaret's safe travels home. We give thanksgiving for Carolyn and Grace and Christopher and Kate for their birthdays this week. We pray for prayers of healing for Janet. I invite you to lift up your own prayers, you know, between you and God at this time. We pray for Helen and for her family. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. Let us bless the Lord. Thanks be to God. Thank you for joining me uh, today. I hope you have a great rest of your day. Bye.